you're right now walking in the supermarket and it is so nice because in the supermarket you can get fresh soup and stuff you can also taste the soup if you don't know what it tastes like uh, what it tastes like and uh, I'm also I also bought a new microphone because I noticed that the that it doesn't record my voice when I'm in the stores or restaurants or somewhere else so that's why I buy both one I really hope it's good in the supermarkets here you can also create your own salad it's super affordable it's crazy it's super delicious uh, so I'm gonna create my salad right now then I'm gonna weigh it and I'm also gonna eat it together with my soup so let's create so you can basically choose your base from here add your toppings and then weigh it and you can also add your sauce and they will wrap it for you so you first need to take a bowl here wearing the gloves obviously but you also have a lot of vegetarian options like plant-based meatballs i think i'm gonna go for this uh, I'm also going to add some uh, beans to it. I just really like to mix things that they don't really make sense together, but I don't care. I just like the separate taste of them. Thank you. So it's really nice. They seal it for you so you could just uh, also take it away. And, uh, so that's really nice. Thank you. It's just crazy how big the supermarkets are here. Like they sell literally everything you can dine in. Literally, you can create your own salads. You can get soup. They just make things really fresh. And they also have like tons of options. I can't imagine having this in the Netherlands. For 160, do you feel that in Zitte? Yeah. Wow, this is really cheap. This is, it looks so crazy delicious. Like, basmati rice, rice with chicken. Um, the other day I even saw rice with katsu chicken. So this costs just 80 baht. We just bought our stuff from the grocery store and it was only 187 baht for a soup for two persons, a salad, and I think something else. No. Oh, that was it. I really have to focus and concentrate <laughs> and see where I'm going because there is literally no overview of where I am, where I'm going to. We are just trying the spot that we were... No, it is actually the other side, volgens mij. Okay, well, let's eat this. I just made a very simple salad, pasta, basically called pasta. So the salad was 100 baht. Um, they weigh it for you. And the soup was, um, this was the bigger size, so it was 80 baht and we took the bigger one. This is all just very new for me because in the Netherlands we just don't have stuff like this. They don't pack your soup. They don't give you heated soup and they put this fresh in the box for you depending on whatever you want. You might find it odd that I'm coming to Thailand and I basically eat soup and salads but the thing is there is so much food that you can pick from <laughs> i basically don't know what i want to eat there are so many options i get them super hungry and then i pick to just eat a salad And you see that now a lot. I also saw it in London um, and they have a lot of shops here in Thailand as well, especially in the malls. I do have the iced matcha latte 
I do have to say the prices are a bit higher than when you would order it somewhere else. So let's taste this as usual. I would say it's very pure as well. Uh, no sugar, or at least that's what I'm tasting. Mm. But it is good. But it's a nice environment to sit in. So this is what it looks like. And you are basically sitting on bricks and stuff. This is where you can order. It is always such a nice and cool design. Sushi tent, which is located in Sukhumvis, Pompong, next to M Quartier, and it's in the in the street next to it, in the side street. The reviews were good, so that's the reason why we came here. It is just a small restaurant, like very tiny, small, uh, which makes it super cozy to be here. We just ordered sushi, but we already had to order everything that we wanted because they are closed. So I really hope that what we picked was good. It looked really good. Let's see. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, this looks so good. So what we have here is the avocado tempura roll. This makes me really happy. It looks so good. This is um, with shrimp and this is the one with avocado. So it's tempura but it also has cream cheese. So is it good? Really good. Okay, so we ordered another one of this one. Um, cheese does. I didn't manage to taste it together with the lemon. The atmosphere of the restaurant is also not, it isn't too decorated but that's I think the charm of it because it's very it's a tiny area so there are only four tables and then you also have I think two or three tables on the other side. We need to go outside and then go to the other side. So the atmosphere is really cozy. If you combine it with the lemon, wow. It's just a super tiny slice of lemon, but it adds so much taste to it. I actually wish I had ordered something else so I could taste it. Uh, but on the other hand, it was really good. So the total was 1,800, oh, 1,188. That's what you're gonna get if you wanna have sushi. Okay, so we're walking back home. 